everyone, Loremaster of Sotek, and we are back with another episode of the Alithnar campaign, which is starting to get really exciting. Um, oh, I've got a rebellion coming up? Oh. Well, that, I'm totally not prepared for that. Hopefully my defensive allies will be willing to assist me. The chaos corruption there is a little high. Nice way to look. No, Teclas. Well, I, I might do a military alliance with Teclas. We'll have to play that by ear, see. Things are going very well. Um, we're about ready to upgrade our third army with its final components of dragon princes and dragons, which is going to be excellent. Uh, and last episode, we ended with that awesome battle against against Clan Rictus, led by uh, Queek Headtaker, because it seems the Skaven, the world over, have unified into a single force. Which, uh, I just killed their one of their larger armies. So I imagine their balance of power took a bit of a hit. But I think they're they're fairly... I mean, they're still up there. I'm power rank 1 or 2, and they're still, like, have a reasonable amount of red. That was a very uh, enjoyable siege, though. Wonder Yours if we'll be able to top it. Span. So why... Um, join war against the Blue Vipers? I don't really want to fight Greenskins, man. Thanks, but no thanks. This has actually been a really interesting uh, playthrough. I'm not used to seeing the AI organized quite like this into these large um, empires. Um, normally, the AI, Can when I, I play, instance? like, you know, it, it'll do stuff, um, but... You know, right now we've got all of the Dark Elves have unified under a single banner. All of the Lizardmen have unified under a single banner. And all of the Skaven have uh, um, have unified under a single banner. I mean, I guess, yeah, Last Defenders haven't confederated yet. But that doesn't seem like it's that far off. Uh, and Ulthawan is still split in half. Borders. But uh, thankfully I've remained one of the more powerful factions on the map. Uh, ooh, yeah, we need to get Quartermaster right away, because this army is very expensive. Dragon Princes and a Star Dragon. That is what I'm talking about. What an army. Um, immortality. Great. That's a noble I don't have to worry about anymore. Yep, I am pretty, pretty pleased with this army. Uh, we'll probably trade out one of these Phoenix Guard for the Keepers of the Flame, but they're still not recruitable at the moment. You're still waiting. Upgrade that. Oh, wait, 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 no. Upgrade this. That way we can make this place actually defensible. Um, over here, we're working on that. It's going to take quite a few turns for that to be ready. And our hero here, unfortunately, cannot get any more influence. Oh, he's under, like, attack. That's not fun. Well, hopefully he'll fail to assassinate him again, because that'll just make him harder to assassinate. But I think our goal this episode is we might confederate with Tyrannok. Um, I kind of want to check to see what lands they own over in uh, Ulthuan, uh, just because that would give me full control of uh, that would give me control over Arnheim, which is pretty critical to control over this part of Nagaroth. Oh, he got a critical success. Oh, rude. Followed by a critical failure. Hmm. So that noble is just dead. He's just dead dead. Granted, if they were going to kill off one of my nobles, that's probably the one I care the least about, but still, that's disappointing. Um, yeah, we're, we're pretty much at war with all the major enemies now. Um, I'm trying to smooth things over with Hexital. And get it to where we're legit allies, but, uh... Well, let's just say Mazda Mundi is being a little resistant the on the Crown subject. Heavily on uh, yes, I will accept this now. I am going to start looking for legit military allies. Because at this point in the campaign, um, basically I need to start forging alliances that will last. Alright. So, we need to unleash a brand new noble... Who's terrible. Minus 5 melee attack, perfect. You're not going to be fighting, so that works. Secure influence. 
Um, assassinate and specialist. And you will head for the black pillar immediately. You ship out immediately. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah. Upgrade Hack Grave, because that is worth a lot. The cold. The mirror pool I'm very I'm interested in, because we need to get a stellar garrison there, and that's going to take time. Um, let's see. Let's get Bowmaster. Oh, my mage is back. Slowly. Um. Very well. Do you want to help me with this? I mean, Quintex does have a garrison. It, it, it is true. It's not completely defenseless, but still. Your behest? Okay, two turns till that's done. Oh, uh, Lithanar is ready to march. Excellent. Too much southern blood Excellent. Let's get uh, more replenished troops. And then, ah, oh god, did we just go for Nagarond? I feel like we should sh secure this area first. That way I don't have to fear any attacks from the west. Then we go after Nagarond. That seems like the wiser decision. Especially since the... Ah, oh, I can't reach it. Oh, they're about to have a rebellion here. Hopefully it appears in Storag Kar instead of the Temple of Cain. Do not look for me in the light. No. No, but thanks. So I would like to control this province as we just continue our uh, significant assault upon all that Malekith holds dear. We'll make him pay for every inch of land! We're starting to get a little bit... Excuse me, of pressure on, uh... Clan Rictus now as well. I, need, I want to hurry up and claim the Fallen Gates, but that's going to take a few turns, unfortunately. Something just happened. What is this blue color? Oh, Tyrannok took Tyrant's Peak? Why? Also, you're supposed to be attacking Titan Peak. This is starting to get a little out of hand. Oh, hello, Hunters of Kurnos. I uh, hope y'all are friendly and don't require me to bash your faces in. I mean, I don't have a problem doing it. It's just, you know, that takes work and time. Uh, let's see. A mage building here would also be good. I don't think any of these other buildings provide... Oh, you know what? No, we need a Temple of Assurin. Wait, no, not here. This place is fine. So this place we want a mage thing. Here we need a Temple of Assurance instead of the uh, Dragon Lair. We need a Temple of Assurance here to hold back the Chaos Corruption because it's just obnoxious here. Um, there was only let's vengeance. take the K Temple of Cain. To me, Shadow Warriors. The Shadow King it. rises. Uh, this is nope. Not one Druki on Nagareth. All right. Um. Get Militia Master. So I think all these units are accounted for. Reavers. Chariots. Hmm. Grab Indomitable. Alright. What do you require? Not oh, I, can't, possible. I can't attack heroes on the open sea? Isn't that interesting? Go get influence. Go do your job. Alright, you'll be ready to march next turn. If these guys are still here, we're probably just going to kill them. Just because they're probably not going to be friends.
and then I'll march down to deal with him. Two turns until, well, technically two turns until your army's ready to march, though it's a little beat up. Your Visi has confederated with Ulth or, uh, Lothern. That's good. I'm just going to hit the fast forward button. Because I just want to get through this turn as quick as possible. We'll need to keep an eye on that army that's at sea. Because they might be going for the uh, Harganeth. Or not Harganeth, uh, Hagrafe. Which I do not want to give up easily. I want to make them work for it if they're going to try and take it from me. Come in peace. Perhaps you may. Uh, military alliance with the dwarves? Sure. They seem cool. It's making Liberus not like us very much, but that seems kind of unavoidable. Alright. So, what? One turn until. Yep, that Swordmaster's ready. Here, we need a Shrine of Assurin for anti chaos corruption. Uh, ta 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 ta. Bleakhold Fortress needs a bunch of stuff. So does the Circle of Destruction. Let's get that to level three. Give me more trinkets. All right, let's get rid of these guys. They're just a little too annoying. Moving out. Please don't make me chase you too far. The Asua need duty is its own. Alright, so they're out of my way. Your behest? And your job is to march here. And save it from Chaos's predations. Your instructions. You might pick it, be able to pick up the fourth army very soon, which will be nice. Uh let's see. Quartermaster of Lightning Strike. Excellent. You secure me some influence. That's the done. Not a lot, but a little. Uh let's work on we do want him to like us after all. Speaking of Hagrave, how far away is this army? What is this foolishness? Ah, I have a bad feeling she's going to attack the Circle of Destruction and take it. It's not the biggest army, but it's no. big enough. Uh, how far away? Uh, it's 16 turns. Let's go ahead and summon him. He won't be able to move until next turn, but Attend. we'll Attack to figure now. out what we're going to do. Both Skrulk and Krok are pretty far away. Nagarith prepares for war once more. My kindred's embrace. Ooh, the Star Lance. Nice. I know just who to give that to. Uh, Indomitable. What is broken can be remade. You let's grab a third point in Pit of Shades. And I you let's grab a Steed, so you can be where you need to be. Shadow and then Star we will take Storag Quarter. Uh, it's really there's a garrison. To come, me, Shadow Warriors. I'll come back and do this in a minute. Alright, but that'll finish off the elves in this area. Um, I'm pretty sure this is all... Skaven. But, one step at a time. Oh, these guys are actually making pretty good progress in this area. Annoyingly. Orders? Uh, let's see. External mail, no crit that. Garrison, Elven Garden, and we'll save up, I guess, for the next thing. Alright, you're on the move, you're probably going to attack the Circle of Destruction and make me want to kill myself, but whatever. In fact, let's actually hold off on these constructions until we can be for sure. Much rather get a... I can't afford it. 
<laughs> I'd much rather get a wizard building over here. Um, I guess we could get a handmade gallery so I can just pick them up here as well. It improves in untainted as well. You never mind, then we'll put in the ancient city quintex. I'll just save them for a wizard thing. It's fine. Alright. Um Nagareth vengeance! Nagareth prepares for war once more. We'll attack this. Uh, I would auto resolve, but I'm worried I might lose too many troops. Um, whereas if I do this manually, I know that I can take it with pretty minimal effort. Thank goodness we have the siege attacker trade on the dragon. That's going to allow us to sort of just speed through all this nonsense. This is a fairly easy fortress to take. I kind of prefer when they're a little bigger, or like a cornered one, when you have like a big stealth thing, but... <sighs> Let's see. Definitely gonna reroll that. Oh wow, this place ain't looking so hot. <laughs> what the heck? Yeah, there's just like a big old tower that broke and fell over. <laughs> Alright. So we are going to swarm... This, I don't like that she's in the middle of that. We're just gonna swarm this flank. And then... You all... are going to attack the other flank. Like, good boys and girls. Orders. Devoted servant. It will be done. Scion of America. Let's go. Shooting. Move up to about here. Good. Setting four. We'll move up just outside of range, so we can just ping the hell out of them. Alright, he's probably just now seeing these guys. Kill this unit. Now this ability would be so devastating in multiplayer. Because it just auto-kills all those guys that fall in. Just collapse into the depths, screaming. Not a fun way to go. <laughs> would not be my top, my, you know, my top, my top selection. Just keep putting the pressure on. Because once these guys are out of the way, the dragon will have a way in. Let's turn this off. That way y'all can swarm up without any big problems. And uh, let's have a Luthanar shoot this. Pew! Nice. Okay, nice. So there's no one up here to contest us now. So we're just going to run up... So I can shoot over the walls. We'll bring the dragon on in. This is... I love this strategy. You just, you just mow people down. Gonna turn all these guys on combat stance and unleash them. Fail. 
can get my mage on the horse. Bye. And snap. Run the other way. Don't don't run into the darkness, please. <laughs> don't get yourself killed. Bunch of dummies. All right, we took pretty minimal damage. I'm I'm more than pleased. I'm pretty sure a good chunk of that damage was caused by my own shadow spell at the end there. What has broken can be remade. Indeed. We will make you welcome. Alright, so the black road is now mine. Alifa na. So now I can head back this way to take the war to Nagarond proper. How can I uh, let's see how things are going around here. Can I offer assistance? You'll be ready to march next turn. I'm marching my dragon army, or my elite army, as quickly as it its little feet will carry it to war. There we go. Wizard Hall. Rah! More research tech. Rah! Because <laughs> the faster I get research, the faster I get upgrades, and the faster I get upgrades, the happier I am. My only concern is spilling the blood of traitors, and you are in. Nah, I'm pr pr pretty sure she's high up on the traitor list, Elithar. I don't think she's in the way. Gosh, she's strength rank four. She's a higher strength rank than me right now. She must have a ton of armies sequestered up north. Maybe she's fighting Avalorn right now. Is that where all her armies are? I'm not sure. They're up to something. Well, at least the Chaos Army took some damage. Oh gosh, he has so many things I want. Uh, get Earth Blood. You know what? We're gonna go after this chick. We'll deal with Chaos later. One step at a time. What do you I can't do anything to him because he's at sea. Destruction. Failure. <laughs> Loser. Right. Shattered realm. Make way. We march for Nagarond. It's time to take the fight to Big Daddy himself. He has many crimes to answer for. Uh, you. You know what? Screw it. Try and make it to the Southlands. I don't think it's physically possible to make it there in time. Let's see. Skrulk's out at sea, so you might be able to figure out where he's going and catch him. There's no way you're going to get to Krokgar in time, though. Well, maybe. Shadow War. And just a ton of stuff. Now, Skrulk's worth way more, though. So we definitely want to go for Skrulk. Skrulk's worth, like, a kajillion. Gajillion billion dollars. 
Uh, the mirror pool can level up. Excellent. The fallen gate has fallen to what? Unlikely. Skaven? Setting off. Um. Moving out. Be careful. Am I not in friendly territory? Oh no, I am. You could barely see that sliver of healing bar. Ugh. Just be cautious. All right. Um, Ancient City Quintex will hold out for a ways longer. Everything else is pretty much as upgraded as it's gonna get. I'll try and upgrade the Circle of Destruction. Can you make it to the Circle of Destruction? No. But her army is not that amazing. What is this foolishness? It's very dangerous. I'll give it that much. Um, <laughs> just, it's just very dangerous. Um, hopefully she'll fight Aurelius, though. I doubt it. She'll probably just attack my weaker settlement and run for it, but we'll see what happens. How are you doing, Maz? Oh, we're at 100 now. Oh, I've been trading with you. Okay. Why won't you not aggression with me, bro? Why you gotta be so stubborn? Well, they're both a big pain in the butt. Things are improving with Kimri. Court of Liberus hates us. Hmm. Hmm. And it's scary, kind of scary seeing those big old Skaven fleets. I'm ready. But we have another resource ritual area under control, which is really nice. And we're marching on another one, being Grand. Which will slowly lead us towards the uh, Moonbow, which would be nice. Circle of Destruction is under attack. Oh, I'm doing mental math in my head. Trying to see if I can win this. No. Mm. Hmm. Anti -larms. The problem is the lack of AP. I have one armor piercing creature who isn't even really an armor piercing unit so now now our odds of winning that were not very high well at least you didn't raise it and that nobles out of commission great oh, she's gonna run for it after her I'm tired of all these dark elves invading me. Like, I'm, we're so close to that province being, like, properly secured. We're nearly there. Lethal grace given for. Do not let her get away. run her down no matter what it takes Ready to battle. and I'm taking the fight to Nagaron proper which will likely bring an end to this war to me shadow warriors granted there's no way they're gonna let me take it they're easily gonna attack me before I even have the chance And the turn after this one, we will be able to begin the third ritual, which is not an easy one. Oh. For the king! What? They must die for order. Hold up! <laughs> Let me look at these Their army comps here. 
No, there's no way the AI wins this, right? I will lead the Asa. No, yeah, there's no way they win this. I will fight this myself. That is some. That is some BS. <laughs> yeah, no, they're just way too outnumbered. Not gonna happen. <laughs> All right. You're going to get it now, Chaos. Like, I don't know if maybe it was just going to try and, like, leave all these guys in their, like, runaway stance. But, like, with a properly layered army, there's no way this is even remotely close. I guess we'll start all over here. Ready. Especially since I have a freaking. Uh, I hate that she gets Apotheosis and Hand of Glory. I wish she had Soul Quench as one of them. Alright, but we have to be aggressive. Because that Hell Cannon is going to reap a tally. Many will die, but for glorious purpose. Oh boy. Hold! Shoot! My lions, charge! Open fire! Get that hell cannon offline. It's <laughs> just so many arrows. Take those halberds offline. They're just getting deleted. Into them! Jay. Like, this is, this is literally a textbook massacre. Alright, let's wrap this up. Why Lions all can fall back. Without fail. Without fail. Next. Like there's just so much <laughs> this is just so much shooting. There's there's nothing the AI can do against it. Whoa. whoa, 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 whoa. Line up. Line up. Let him go. Fall back. Fall back. I don't want y'all getting friendly fired to death. Now shoot. Just... Literally just a machine gun. Like, even Chosen don't stand a chance against that much shooting. Mass death. Just absolute mass death. 
I don't know why the computer thought that was going to be a hard fight. Every, like, nearly every volley was just a dead unit. It's like, but hey, what do I know? <laughs> Alright, so Chaos Glory has been defeated. We'll ransom them for money. Since they don't have any allies, so we don't have to worry about it. someone getting mad at us for ransoming. Let us see. Hmm. All right. For some reason, I thought that happened not during my turn because I'm dumb. Okay, have I done everything I can do? Nagaron, we cannot assault without a full siege structure. It's too powerful of a garrison. Lady of the Phoenix Court. In defense of all right. to the Fallen Gates, where Warhammer Two began. It feels like anyway. Oh, cool. It was literally empty. Then I shall take control of it. And this will... Oh, thank god, they finally took the Titan Peak. Here. Do something with it. Be, be wise, Kotep. Oh, okay, he's actually got a half-decent army. That's nice, at least. Alright. And then I'll march up for Sealed Retour. Okay. I got the situation under control. Alright, and he's going hunt. He's going rat hunting. Goodness gracious. Huh. Yeah, I can't fight more the and the garrison. Retreat. I was hoping we'd be able to well. <sighs> No, we're gonna need we're gonna need more troops. Or to lure her out, which is the more likely option. Get back here, witch! I mean, I'm going to keep pursuing her, which hopefully will lead the dragon army close enough to uh, Nagaroth, or Nagaron, that I can send him to help me. Because if I had that elite army joining me, then we could easily take them down, even on the open field. Do not look for me in the light. I lurk in. What do you want, Court of Libraries? Mm, not really interested in finding them, bro. Thanks though. I got enough problems. Let's see. Let's see, the Wood Elves are dead. Boo hoo. Where is Skrulk? Heading to Ulth one? I guess he doesn't have a base established here, so I guess he's coming to retake it. I have a strong feeling he's going to die, but we'll see what happens with him. Potex Column. Max level wizard place. Alright. Oh, you 
He's gonna catch her. Now, these armies are fast. I don't even have a mod for this. I'm not it sure how I caught her. Done. Not that I'm complaining. Execute. My strength is rewarded. Well done. Well Leave done. The grace given for. Too much southern blood in Alright. Let's grab Renowned and Feared and uh, Elven Healing. The greater good has triumphed. Deadly onslaught. Alright, march north serve. and join me march in Nagarond as quickly as possible. Come, Shadow Warriors. We're gonna come heal over here. Ambush. Are you at war with Arnheim? We're still working on things with the uh, old man, etc. Arcan conduit. Bada bing, bada boom. All right. Um, things are stabilizing in many places, which is good. Hotex column is now max level, so we can switch this to tribute to the Phoenix King, which is awesome. Clark Harond is coming along. And we've got uh, the Black Flood surprisingly well under control. Alright, so we'll be able to start the ritual this turn, uh, but we're not going to. I'm probably going to wait until I, I just uh, I take Nagareth. Or Nagarond. Military alliance with Teclas. I honestly think I'm going to agree to it because I don't. I'm not going to confederate with Teclas. Like, he is too all over the place. For me to want to confederate. But I don't want to enter a military alliance with him. Because I feel like he's going to get into a war with Cetra soon. And I don't want to be involved in that. So I think I'll sit that one out. No thanks, Teclas. No thanks. Or thanks, but no thanks, rather. Really hoping we can get Morthy to just leave Nagarond and I can approach it with both armies and attack it in the same turn because if I got both armies on it, we could take it. Oh, she's walking right into our trap. Um, I'm in friendly territory, so I'm just going to auto resolve that. My Rillian Reavers died. Of all the things. I'm in power. But that leads leaves Nagarond undefended. Woo! Rank 40! Hallelujah! We got a full rank of Lithanar. Now I just gotta get his stupid bow. Let's see, let's see, let's see. The shadows come, the day wanes. Are you prepared for dusk? What do you want? Defensive alliance? Got it. I like having defensive bros. Loyalty is rewarded. Uns un unseasonable weather. Okay. Lowers healing, but increases recruitment. Hmm. Uh, for your last two. Got all the melee stuff. Got all the top stuff. Got all the blue stuff I want. So all that's left is red stuff. So let's just grab Cav Master. Well. Let's grab Master Strategist instead of, in, in case I decide to upgrade my army. Alright. And our wizard hit that, so we can actually start freaking upgrading our spells. Let's get you a steed first. I do not know them well. Um, Valor of Ages. Can I offer assistance? You are going to haul butt up here and join me. Shadow King. Hunt. Make can I get reavers in a single turn? I think I can. 
Yes, awesome. Alright, and this guy, I'm actually going to drop a Phoenix Star unit and Lord give you the Corp. Keepers of the Flame. Hag Grave can, is upgrading. Money, 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 money! I love money so much. I wish I had more of it in real life, too. <laughs> um, Alright, spices are useful, but not for right now. Uh, we need growth, especially in a small settlement. That is this kind of climate. Like, you know, not super friendly climate. Alright. Mazda Mundi still kind of hates our guts, but, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll deal with it. Okay, this is stabilizing the chaos here a bit. And when you're healed up, we'll have you attack Sealed Little Tor. Um, it's one of my favorite settlements to say. Sealed Tor. For some reason, it amuses me greatly. Alright, um... I think that's good. How powerful is Tyrannok? request. So if I can federate with him, I'd get control of two gates. Um, let's see. Two gates. Oh, and a full province. And that's it? No extra baggage? Alright. Um, it would give me those two full gates. And then just stuff that I need. Alright, I'm not going to confer with him just yet, uh, because he's still kind of running around doing conquering stuff, I think. I could have sworn I saw Tyrannok's army a second ago. Did I not? Oh no, Tyrannok's gone. Okay. Well, I'm going to go ahead and confederate with him. Welcome. What would you have the Asur do? Ah, uh, you don't want to confederate with me. I'm going to I'm gonna have to sweeten you up somehow. Damn it. <laughs> um, okay, I need influence. Because I need to make them like me more. And I don't really feel like pissing off the Norskins. Who are presumably not that powerful right now, but still, you know, principle stands. Alright, I would need more nobles. I just want to flood the area with nobles. I await your orders. Who will hopefully look out for each other. Whoops. How long until that one comes back? Two turns? Ugh. Brave son of Uthwan. You're to set out immediately. More nobles, I say! More! <laughs> Alright. Shadow Hand is heading south. And, okay, looking at the time, looks like we'll have just enough time to kind of check our empire and do the Siege of Nagarond. Which is going to be chaos. But fun. How fares your soft southern realm, my kin? What's up, L'Oreal? Nah, I'm okay being friends, but I don't want to be, like, super friends. I like you as just a defensive alliance. It's me, not you. <laughs> Get defensive alliance zoned! Uh... Wonder, I wonder how long it's going to be before we get the final Dark Elf thing. It can't be that long, because I imagine they want it to tie into the DLC. Because it's part of the DLC. So I imagine they want to tie it in as quickly as possible. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Interesting. And it looks like the Tomb Kings are finally having some success, so that's nice. Alright. Where is Skrulk at this moment? Invading Ulthuan. Okay. Well, I've got good news for you, Fauna here. You are also going to invade Ulthuan. <laughs> er, not Ulthuan, Lustria. Good luck, have fun. Um, in the meantime, 
more mage towers, which equals faster research, which is good. Light my path. Go there secure influence of the Black Pillar. Born to lead. More nobles. Oops, not assault units. I don't care about that. Dark-hearted fools. Stop it for the moment. All right. There's prey. It's time. Ready. Fearless. I will lead the charge against Nagarond. Nagarith vengeance. Time going to for be battle. a bonkers fight. Um, more than likely. Maybe it'll be super easy. I Maybe I'm remembering it. it as being harder than it is, but we'll see. Too much Just blood. curious. Is there any better equipment I could give you? Well, I should probably look at that after this fight. <laughs> Moving on. Alright. While that's doing that, let's upgrade Storag Core. And oh yeah, we can do a vortex ritual. Okay. Lord of the Phoenix Court. But if this doesn't get the Dark Elves attention no and anger, then I don't Ah Man, it's so tempting just to auto-resolve it so I don't have to do it. But this is a big deal fight. Let's actually save. Nagareth prepares for war once more. Nagareth capturing Nagarond is one of the most important parts of any high elf campaign. Especially since once they lose this, the only, like, true capital they'll have still standing is, uh, Harganeth, which will fall much- which will fall quickly after as well. Though, my armies at this point will have to divide and conquer. Because I'm gonna need some people to go north and some to go east. This will be interesting. Problem is, there's so many of them, it's hard to do my usual <laughs> antics. Alright, our allies are coming on from that direction, so we want to lure the enemy... ...to their side, because that army will do well in that circumstance. So we're going to unleash our... ...super awesome army on this part of the wall. And our main force is going to attack this side of the wall. Oops. Right, sisters. Let's do it like that. And then like that. And you two will ride with them. Chariot. These dudes. Dargan. We're just gonna do some really broad groups because there's gonna be so many bonus troops coming in. Whoops, you should be with them. All right, hopefully the AI falls for it again. All right, let's go. Actually, let's go on here. All right, take evasive action. Right, to the bottom of this hill, roughly. Yeah. Forward. Moving out. Forward. My power is yours. I go there. Alright, both are. Take out that gate. Uh, well, I get the rest of my army organized. Phoenix Guard in front. White Lions and Swordmasters behind. White Lions! Swiftly! Prince. Or, well, group. You're with them. 
Dragon Prince's line over here. Flyers. And sisters. Alright, we're taking the walls. See if I can get that damn dragon's attention. Ooh, you got too close. You got too close. Alright. How are we doing over here? Good. Flyers! Let's do this! Let's go! Dragon Princes, head for the gate. Sisters of Avalorn, fall forward. You come with us. Let's tell these guys to go ahead and retreat. We head for the center of the city! Brave and true. We'll go after that dragon. Y'all light up this wall. This is not the best dragon breaths I've ever had. Both of you fall this way. That damn gate open. Fetch. Grab that charge a little bit. Light him up! Prince of Oakwood! Warden of Saffarin! Well, that was pretty easy. I almost kind of wish there had been another army there. That it actually probably would have been a half difficult, a half decent fight. <laughs> oh well. It's still an important fight. Because we're we can feel fairly secure now that the uh, that the uh, dark elves' power in the north is broken, which is a wonderful thing. Truly, Wunderval. Sweet mother of load times, come on. We took pretty minimal damage. Her Reavers ate a lot of tower fire, but Aurelius' army only lost 25. Illuminate the Shadowlands. It's finally it's over. Take what we must. Um 
We shall occupy. Channel its riches to Nagareth. Take what we must. You will occupied. pay for this. Their name carries little honor. Goodness. All right, let's grab training. Alifa not. And I have to repair a bunch of junk. Oh, we got it at level four. That's nice. Repair that. Uh, get rid of that. Repair that. Oops. Oops. I said repair. Um. Get rid of that. Marble. Occupied Black Tower of Malekith. Oh wow, that gives you plus 30 relation with Dark Elves? That's funny. So you basically are just like, I'm the boss. <laughs> uh, well, we're not going to save a slot for that because we get a slot for that next level. Um, yes, let's build a Shrine of Assurance to fight the corruption here. Alright. So you will go capture Har Kaldra for us. Oh man, we have a bunch of money. I love it. Is there anything I need to buy? We're looking pretty good most places. Uh, the mirror pool's ready to be upgraded. Um, we just need growth. Just like excessive amounts of growth here. Princess of the Asylum. So we can get the mirror pools to where I can properly defend them. Where are my nobles? I await your orders. I've already moved. Alright, uh, I think we're good to end this turn then. I've already moved that one hero. Where is he? Yep. Alright, great. This campaign is going swimmingly. Uh, and then we're just gonna hit that fast forward button if we can get away with it. There we go. It's probably time to recruit some more armies since we're taking so much territory. It's starting to get a little ridiculous. <laughs> Everyone's freaking out on my thing because EA's press conference was today and it did not go very well apparently. Apparently they destroyed the Command and Conquer series is what I'm reading. Command and Conquer. Isn't that, isn't that like one of the really old school strategy games? I'll have to see what happened. I heard it's a mobile game is the big thing and knowing EA is probably like requires like a gajillion dollars to pay. And it's just pure pay to win. A recruiting shortage. That's not good. Alright. Keep chasing after Skrulk, who... I'm just waiting for him to do something. He really wants that Altar of the Horned Rat back. Eh, he might get it back. There's not much defending it. Defender of the Evergreen. Let's see what happens. Um, meanwhile, in the north... Alfuin Prince. I'll have this guy deal with the West. Uri Bear, a strong leader is weak. As we try and, and get this place under control. Marble. Uh, dragons and a forge. Oh wait, no, we need more untainted, so... Let's do Handmaid's Gallery. Garrison. Your instructions. We're making almost ten K a turn. Addition. Jesus. Uh Elven healing. I do not know them well. We got replenished troops going on. Let's grab that uh, missile resist since you're flying on a flying on a bird. I'm ready. Uh, we will Attack march out now. to the Great Arena. Because Nagaron will stabilize. Especially with that one dude to conquering battle. it. What has broken can be remade. Capture this. Uh, that's actually okay. 
I just went level 3, we'll just grab this. We have to go north to claim the rest of this region. But this is looking really good. The Dark Elves' power is uh, finally shattering. It's being, it's being pressured quite nicely. For honor. Yep, up, 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 up. Wait, Let's did this dude land? Setting sail. Kill him. Daggers in the dark. I apologize. Eighteen percent chance. Oh, this dude's level thirty-eight. <laughs> Brave and true. This makes sense. True son of smash it to ruins. And you failed me. Did I mention I hate you guys? So what settlements do I need to defend for the ritual? Black Creek, Karankar, and Hotex. Oh, the classics. Okay. Alright. Um, we're not ready to begin the ritual just yet because our guys are all over the place. Um, I need to wipe out the elves out of the west. Um, which we're probably just going to conquer all of this. And the reason is because I want these resources. Well, no, I can't build anything here, so I might just burn it to the ground. I don't want to overexpand, which is not really a thing, but, you know. I'd really like to avoid dealing with the Norskins if I can. They dislike me greatly. Unfortunately. <laughs> Despite the fact I've been beating the crap out of their enemies, but, you know, what can you do? Hopefully the Tomb Kings will be expanding aggressively in the uh, absence of power that's formed. Or the vacuum of power. Can, can I devour you, you yet? From the Asura, traveler. Absurd. Damn it. Let me devour you! <laughs> they have eight settlements. There's six here and two here. Yes, because the Skaven or somebody just blew out this place. And I don't even want this one. I literally just want this and I want Tiranok. And I would l be able to do it if I had any fucking influence. But all of my kill targets are... So Where the hell is Malekith anyway? Oh, he's like way off Weakling. fighting Avalorn. Annoying. And my dear little hero has just made it to the Southlands and he's still gotta go all the way down to where Skrulk is Ugh. alright so I'm gonna wait till this turn finishes and then we'll call it on this episode oh goodness If you are not of Nagareth, you are the enemy. You will never have peace, Morathy. Never. I will kill you. <laughs> Rest assured. Goodness. Yeah, I think this will be the last one of these I record for today. I think this is the third episode, so three hours. Duck. Is Skrulk dead? Damn it! I guess we'll hunt down Krokgar instead. Minor consolation prize. Where is he? I have nine turns to get to him. I'm dubious. <laughs> oh, 
Well, it looks like Skrulk was nearly successful. Protector of Alpha. Master of the White. And then Teclas showed up. Well, he wouldn't have lasted that long anyway. All these factions are attacking the Lizardmen. All right, let's take care of our empire real quick, and then we'll be good to go. At your service. Is that the last place I need? Lethal grace given for. Kaldra. Or there's rats in it. Nope, just empty. How can I assist? All right, so Nagarond is under my control. Burden of the Shadowlands. And Grand is seen to follow. Uh, pick another pendulum point. I sense sedition. Get Valor of Ages. Shattered Realm. From the shadows. Ah, that seems like a good stopping point. All right, everyone, thank you for watching. Next time we'll start off with the uh, Siege of Grand, which probably won't be all that difficult, but I just don't have the time to play it in this episode. So thank you for watching. I will uh, see you for next time. Take care of yourselves, and until then, bye.